Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you a few different websites that will pay you via PayPal to answer questions about all sorts of things. The first one is mylot.com. Basically this is a place where you can start like forums and stuff like that where you get paid based on the type of forum or discussion that you start or the answers that you question or the answers that you uh, give to questions within these types of discussions, Be meaning basically the most value that's added, the more you get paid. The minimum you'll need to cash out every month when you uh, participate in these discussions is $5. You get paid via PayPal. The higher your content, your discussion, or your answers are rated, the more money you can get paid. So you can go on here and look at all sorts of different discussions on here and sign up at the top left to get started. Another website is basically going to allow you to text people uh, from your phone and answer their questions about business. So if you are pretty business minded or you have experience as an entrepreneur, you can get paid to do this with about 50 cents per answer. You get paid via PayPal and uh, it's basically all taken care of through your phone. So you can go to oneq.com slash members to register and then you just sign up here, you answer questions, you can do this for both Apple and Android devices. They have an app that you can check out right there. And uh, it's just kind of an easy way to get paid for your business expertise. Another thing you can do is directly. You can go to directly.com. This is a place where if you have a lot of expertise with say Apple products or say uh, PCs or you have a lot of expertise with just you know, maybe it's uh, an Xbox or something. There's a lot of different types of products or a lot of different companies that people might have been using for years and years and have a lot of expertise in these areas. And some people want specific types of questions about specific types of companies or products answered. And they need someone who's been using these types of things for a long time. So Instead of something like Quora, will people have, you know, just questions and answers all the time or like Yahoo Answers or something like that. Instead, you can actually get paid for your answers if you help people with a question related to a specific type of company or product that people are having trouble with. So you can go to directly.com to um, go here and start answering people's questions. And basically, you can cash out with as little as $2 in earnings. You keep 50% of what the customer pays you for providing the answer, and you get paid within two to four days via PayPal. Experts123 is another one. You can go to experts123.com, and this is one where you get paid to answer questions or write articles. You get $10 to $20 per article, uh, for instance, and people are hired worldwide, and they have both revenue sharing as well as upfront pay opportunities. So you have a few different options here with what type of content and how you get paid. And then you get paid via PayPal once you have a minimum of $20 earned. So you can either write again or answer questions. You see both options there at the top of the website. And uh, you can read their FAQ here for more information. You're basically a contributor here. And you can just kind of work when you have extra time. You can answer questions or you can do articles for like 10 to $20 each. So with Ouija.com, this is another site you get paid to answer questions that are not already within their database, basically. So when a question gets answered, it is kind of, you know, stored as like a post on the website. Now, if you answer questions that aren't already on the website, then you can get paid for those. You get 20 cents per answer. Once you've made at least $20, your funds can auto transfer to your pay account. So you can go to Ouija.com, answer some random questions and stuff. And uh, you see they have almost 32 million answers. And it's just a way to make a little bit of extra money. You can also check out Study Pool where you can basically become a tutor. And it used to be called Create Pool, but it lets you make money by sharing your expertise. You'll answer questions basically that are academic related. So if you know a lot about certain school subjects and things like that, this could be a great one to do. You just click go become a tutor up there in the top right corner of study pool. And then you can get paid um, to answer these types of questions for all sorts of people who might be students in college or something like that. So you keep 80% of what you earn. The other 20% goes to study pool to help them keep the website going and, uh, other than that, you can just apply now by clicking this button right here, and you can earn up to 
$7,500 USD monthly working from home tutoring students, or at least that's what they claim. So uh, you can see all sorts of highest earners that have made hundreds of thousands of dollars on the site. And some of these questions pay very, very well because, you know, cer certain questions are very difficult and are related to difficult school subjects. Just Answer is fairly similar to some of these other ones where people kind of decide how much they want to pay you for uh, answering a question. And then you can be an expert in a certain field and answer that. So JustAnswer.com is the website. They also have an app that you can use as well for your mobile device. You can get paid 50% of what customers are willing to pay for your answer as your commission. So 50% goes to the website, 50% you get to keep. And then you may be able to make between 20 and $50 per question that you successfully answer. Also, if you want to get paid via PayPal, that is an option. At LivePerson, you can actually get paid via PayPal and you get to set your own hours. You do need a minimum of $50 earned to cash out, but you can get paid to answer people's questions and uh, do it via chat. And as far as applying, you need to check their careers page for chat jobs um, using liveperson.com slash company and then going to their careers. So just look for anything related to chat or answering questions and stuff like that. And hopefully you can find something depending on when you check. They have a lot of jobs on here to scroll through, but um, they can help you make some money just by answering people's questions via chat support. Another way you can make money answering questions is basically uh, without having to necessarily do, you know, get paid by answering each question type of websites that, I, that I've already gone through. You can actually do mystery shopping as well, like Call Center QA is an example. You can go to callcenterqa.org and be a mystery shopper where basically you will have certain questions you're supposed to answer and you kind of, you, you call like customer support or something for a business and then you get paid uh, about $5 per call, which only takes about 10 minutes per call. And then you are going to need to be 18 years of age or older or and reside in the United States to do this. But again, you're just answering questions about like the customer support or the, the experience with certain retailers and stuff like that as a mystery shopper. Another thing you can do is basically answer questions about user friendliness for websites and apps. So IntelliZoom is one that you can use for this. IntelliZoom.com is a place where you can actually get paid to uh, basically just give feedback on websites and apps. So all you do, you get paid via PayPal, two to $10 per review. You do need to be 18 years of age or older. And uh, most of these will only take 10 to 20 minutes. So you are going to just answer a few questions about how you feel about a website, what you would change, things like that, so that they can help improve the user experience. Another one is Try My UI. It's a very similar site to IntelliZoom where basically you test websites and apps. You can get paid to test by clicking the option up there at the very top middle of the page. And this allows you to get paid about $10 for each test that you take, which takes about 20 minutes each. You're again answering questions about user friendliness. You, ask, you also have Userlytics. Userlytics is another site where you answer questions about user friendliness, usability of websites and apps. And uh, a lot of times this is before these get fully released to the public. So you get five to $90 per test with them. What you wanna do is go to tester, sign up in the top right of their blog and then you can see that they pay you 5, 10, 15, 20 or $90 for each test that you take. You only have to be 16 years of age or older and agree to their terms of use and everything of course and then you answer a few questions about what you think about uh, user friendliness of a website or app, what you like and don't like about it. Another one is user testing. User testing also pays you via PayPal to take these types of tests. You can go to get paid to test up here. They pay you via PayPal and all you got to do is get kind of walk through these websites and apps. You get paid $10 for every 20 minute test you complete and even more for interviews about them. So some of them pay you I believe up to like $90 or something like that, or maybe $60. It's something, you know, multiple times what a regular one would pay. And that's kind of the maximum. It's like $60 or something along those lines. You take these tests, you answer questions. It's about websites and apps, and you're just helping them improve their um, functionality. Another thing you can do is answer people's questions about 
uh, certain market trends or whether or not they should get into a certain line of business or to get uh, sources for something or to answer questions about all sorts of things. A lot of it has to do with like trends and market analysis and stuff like that. If you go to askwonder.com, you can become a researcher and get paid 10 to $15 per hour if you sign up and of course get accepted. But uh, you could recommend a product or service. Basically, people will ask you questions and they want you to give you a very data driven answer and uh, lots of sources and stuff like that. So it's you know, it's something that you need to be good at researching and finding very in-depth answers and being able to give them a lot of uh, research about that. So you can find out at the bottom there, again, you get paid about 10 to $15 per hour for helping people um, find new business trends, answer questions about recommendations for, um, you know, demographics to do for their business or whatever. There's a lot of different things they um, can ask you. So another popular way to make money online by answering questions is through tutoring. Tutoring is something you can get paid to do at Cambly.com. You can help people via video chat or via text chat to help people with a lot of different things. And you, of course, are a tutor. You'll be tutoring all sorts of different subjects or just obviously the subject that you're qualified to tutor people in. You do not need experience necessarily, but uh, you probably will have to take some sort of test or something to prove your skills and you will have to work a certain amount each week, but you might have very flexible hours. You might get paid around $10.20 per hour, and you get paid weekly every Monday, and PayPal is an option. So you have courses and certificates and stuff that you can do here. You tutor people via video and chat, and they also have apps that you can use as well. Another one like that is Chegg. You can get paid $20 per hour and maybe $1,000 or so per month to teach students about whatever subject matter you are an expert in as far as academic subjects. You know, this isn't like life advice or business advice and stuff. It's more related to a school subject usually. So you can tutor from anywhere. You don't even have to be at home necessarily, pretty much anywhere with internet. And if you scroll down, you'll be working with middle and high school students, college, or professionals. You can also do reviews for products and answer questions about products. Uh, and then these companies will actually pay you to do that, to give, you, to give a review to the public with your audience. So one website that helps you do this is valuedvoice.com. You can register here in the top right to basically uh, use your social media or blog following or video channel to answer questions about products. Usually you'll get like a free product from companies and they will uh, pay you to do like a sponsored post. This is what a lot of social media influencers and stuff will do or uh, you know bloggers who are also influencers as well. So you get paid within 72 hours via PayPal and you do reviews on social media blogs and uh, YouTube channels. Also, if you have a blog, you can do blog sponsored posts with pay per post. They also pay you to uh, get paired with different companies who will give you products or services to review. And then you post these reviews on your blog. Obviously, they will want to pick people that have uh, blog audiences that are very related to their niche of the company that is trying to pay you. But, um, you know, for instance, if there's a new food product coming out, they might want to find a cooking blog on here on pay per post. And if you have a cooking blog, you can get paid to review maybe a new cooking tool or a new, you know, cooking utensil or something that's coming out from a company that wants to pay you to give your honest impression of it. So you can answer different common questions that your audience has about these products and get paid to post them directly on your blog. And last but not least, Get Reviewed is another one that pays you for this kind of stuff. And what they do is they pay you for basically answering questions on your blog as well about different brands, different products that are coming out and stuff like that. And they are going to pay you to do this sponsored post, probably give you the service or product, and then you get paid to publish that to your audience. Hopefully this video was helpful, and I will see you in the next one.